All right. Ladies and gentlemen, coming at you from the Innovation District in downtown Erie, PA, it's <laughs> Ventures Live. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Slaywin from the Ben Franklin Technology Partners. And on today's show, we'll be talking with a good old Southern boy who founded a technology... You're from the South, aren't you? Yeah, well, South Florida. Not really the South. North Florida's like the South. <laughs> That's right, I forgot. It's it's little, yeah, that. that's right. A good old Southern boy, kind of Southern boy, who founded a technology startup to, uh, that makes video creation so simple. Well, then we'll talk about Erie's innovation community, the startup breakdown, and what it's like to hustle, hustle, hustle. Mm. And finally, he'll tell us who he wants to meet, what his favorite eats are, and then what he'd do if he were a true superhero in Meet, Eat, Conspire, coming up on Ventures Live. But first, here's what's happening in the Erie Innovation District during the next seven days. All right. So this weekend, it's the pop-up shop on Artist Bazaar, where local creators set up and get down. As a bonus, you'll get to meet Chris Wheaton, otherwise known as Mr. Quick Starter. So check it out at... What is that? 145 West 11th Street in Basement Transmissions. Uh, on Wednesday, February 8th, learn the seven secrets to selling success from somebody who knows all about it. This is Jenny Poff. She brings her designer roundtable to anyone looking to learn how to sell anything. That sounds exciting. Mm -hmm. More information is available at designers-roundtable.com. Also on Wednesday, it's the YEP networking event at Mad Max Erie starting at 5.30 p.m. So meet up, max up, and network with the young Erie professionals. On Thursday, you can take your first step to becoming an entrepreneur at the Gannon SBDC First Step. It starts at 6 p.m. You can learn more at the sbdcgannon.org. Did I say it right? Mm hmm Okay, cool. Under, Under ed educational <laughs> program. <laughs> <laughs> also on Thursday, check out the Chic, and then... That's how you say that, right? I think. Check out the Chic, and then on Friday, it's the dead of night. Oh, it's movies. Oh. Exclusively at the Erie Movie House. Nice, nice. So next Thursday and Friday, they've got all these great movies. Awesome. At 3424 Westlake Road. Okay. And I think it's eriemoviehouse.com. Right. Have you ever been there? I have not been oh, there. Oh, it was so cool. Last week or uh -huh. two weeks ago, we went there. They, Craig Stadler and his fiancée, Nicole, did a whole thing for us. It was really great. That's awesome. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I and haven't then, been there yet, but I have friends and family who have been there. It's very cool. I hear good things. It's very cool. Okay. Then finally on Friday, February 10th, check out the marketing workshop for 2017 put on by Jenny Poff from Presque Isle Design. More info at presqueisledesigns.com. And of course, all kinds of information about that and more is available on Facebook in the Erie PA Entrepreneurs Group or on Twitter at the hashtag, there is nothing to do in Erie. So, Matt Silva, welcome to Ventures Live. Yeah, thank you, Brian. I really appreciate it. How you, did you uh, get to... You appreciate me what? Putting this on and Absolutely. what you're doing. And, uh, <laughs> I, I interrupted, sorry. That's okay. So, Matt, tell us, how did you get to Erie? Okay. Tell us about your experience in South Florida. Okay. Tell us about Matt Silva. Sure. Uh, so how did okay, I get Matt, to Okay, Matt, that was awesome. Thank All you. All right. Have a good day. Uh, you can be watching. See you <laughs> No, kidding. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, no, how did I get to Erie? Uh, drove in the middle of December. <laughs> turn left at noon. Turn left, yeah. Uh, you know, get out of Florida, turn left, and keep on going straight. Skip West Virginia. No, just kidding. So what brings you here to Erie? Uh, family, primarily. Yes, we get a lot of them that way. That's right. That's right. Uh, so family primarily, and then the prospect of actually launching a startup from family support. Yeah. Um, I know this is kind of an echoing of the story, but uh, originally had not anticipating launching Render Effects here in Erie. I was thinking about doing uh, a an accelerator like nearby, like at Techstars or Y Combinator, and just having the family support to be able to do that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but fortunately enough, was able to you know, connect with some pretty amazing groups and individuals here, and launch uh, Render Effects. You know. So the idea behind Render Effects is what? What do you do if you get to use what Render Effects? So there's really uh, there's a few there's actually 
quite a few ideas uh, behind render effects, but at the core, it's really allowing you know businesses, people who weren't able to create these high-end motion graphic videos, to create them really easily without having the intervention of somebody who's like a video professional, uh, a professional artist, right? So uh, you have zero skills, you have you know messaging, you have marketing, you have content. Things that you were not able to get into the video space and tap into that, yep. you are able to do that now with our platform. So at the Ben Franklin Technology Partners, we've actually built, I don't know, a half dozen of those. Right. And right. literally it takes 10 minutes or something, and I'm no video <laughs> master. So it takes about 10 minutes to get things put together. Right. Then you've got a very professional video right. on the out, on the outflow. Right, and the reason why it's so efficient is because all of the design is taken care of for you. So you don't have to worry about the timing, the animation, the design, yeah. all those things that you just, you spend a lot of time and money usually trying to craft. Yep. All you have to do is go plug your message in and boom, you got a pretty good So you're growing a company here yep. in Erie. What's yep. the startup scene like in Erie? And I mentioned hustle, hustle, hustle. You guys seem to be always out there doing something. Tell me a little bit about your experience in the innovation district in Erie in general. Yeah, uh, I mean, there is a good group of entrepreneurs here. Yeah. Uh, some interesting folks here. I mean, we're in the Erie uh, Technology Incubator right now. I don't know yeah. if you know the guys next door. They do. Uh, we have a couple of really bright entrepreneurs. Uh, Medical Opinion Center? Nope. Uh, Fitly Health. Oh, no, I don't know those guys. Yeah. Fitly Health? Yeah, Fitly Health. I've never met them. I'll have See? to meet them. So this is part of it. This is part of it. <laughs> is is cultivating new entrepreneur and networking and awesome. trying like that's that's to me that's super important is knowing who's doing what and trying to help them, trying to help them network, trying yeah. to help them succeed. The Gannon <laughs> ETI is a program within a facility right. at Ninth and State. That's correct. Right? And so we're actually in the palatial offices of Render FX. Mm -hmm in the ETI, and right. there's, I don't know, a dozen or so startup companies here, yep. Yep. some pure tech like RenderFX, right. there's med tech like right. the guys at MedioCard. Right, there's, right, yep. Yesterday we had a really awesome announcement where uh, Innovatel announced a $2 million equity investment. They're in a med services system, mm -hmm. so yeah, I mean it's- Yeah, like it's, really, really bright people like Zach Stallsmith from Apex Drop. Right. Uh, doing some cool things with influence marketing, but uh, yeah, I mean, quick plug on the ETI here. Uh, it's the uh, just uh, an incubator here for businesses, uh, in particular, who have some type of technology component to them. We happen to be kind of the more uh, you know traditional cloud technology yep. uh, that you would you would normally see coming out of like the Bay Area. Very cool. All right, everyone, a hand for Matt. Thanks, Silver. Sarah. All right. <laughs> now it's time for our always wonderful yep. meet, eat, conspire. Matt, tell us. Anyone in the whole world, dead or alive, who would you like to meet? Um, so, you know, I put some hard thought into this, and I really couldn't <laughs> I figure bet it out. you did. <laughs> <laughs> no, I did. I did. Lots of lots of driving and thinking, like, hmm. Who would you really like to meet? Uh, actually, my, my answer to that isn't one specific person. It's uh, continually meeting people here in Erie who are entrepreneurs who are helping driving. Uh, the startup initiative and the entrepreneurial initiative here. That's who I'd like to meet and awesome. I'd like to continue to meet. And so what is your favorite mm -hmm. food, Matt Silva? So favorite. last, just as a reminder, last week it was Sean Fedorko mm -hmm. and Sean said pizza and scotch. Oh, that's specific. That's yeah. PB and J, I know you have children at home. Yeah. So it's tip I would imagine your favorite eats are whatever they didn't finish. Right. Usually they're, they say, what are their favorite eats? Because my chicken, chicken my favorite fingers. eats usually don't uh, don't populate the house. Usually it's pop tarts. I have a friend. <laughs> I have a friend uh -huh. who, when his daughters were like three years old, mm -hmm. he wrote up a contract. What do you want for your wedding reception for dinner? And there was like macaroni and cheese yep. and chicken yep. fingers yep. and French fries. And he had him sign it in crayon, of course. Now it's sitting in a safe deposit box, so when his daughters get married, he'll pull out that contract. And <laughs> All right. Awesome. Finally, who, if you were a superhero, yep. if Matt was a superhero, and he is, right? Because he does magic, he makes his fingers wiggle and magic happens out of the internet. Right. Who 
No, what is the question? If you were a two superhero, <laughs> two superhero. what power would you have and mm -hmm. what would you do with it? Um, my superhero ability would be able to, I'd be able to take someone like Brian and I'd be able to suck all of his knowledge and oh, stick yeah. it into here. Yeah, 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 right. right like right. that's, that's, that would be my superpower is absorbing knowledge. Absorbing knowledge. Instantaneously right. and then having it for a real application. All right, another big hand for Matt Silva. <laughs> all right, just a quick reminder, everyone, and tell your friends, Ventures Live is every Friday at 9 o'clock streaming live inside of the Innovation District on the Peer, uh, Erie PA Entrepreneurs Group. And next week, you can join us as we welcome the entrepreneur's friend, John De Silva. Uh -huh. Hey, are you guys related? Silva, De Silva, no? We might as well be at this point. <laughs> the founder of MMIIP, the best intellectual property law firm in Northwest PA, and also the lead curator of TEDx Erie. Mm -hmm. TEDx Salons, he's also doing TEDx Erie Youth, he's very involved in that whole system. Um, from his amazing offices on the main level in this very building. So That's we're on right. the third That's floor. Right. Yeah. It's secure, so you can't get in and all of that. But we're on the third floor. We're going to go down to John's office in the lower level, and he's going to talk about how to protect your idea hmm. and how, in the end, ideas really don't matter. <laughs> Only execution does. All right, very and true, finally, since the clothes make the man and <laughs> shoes speak louder than words, you know what time it is? Uh, no, tell me what's up. It's time for what's on your feet. So, uh, wish Matt, I wish I came prepared for this. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, right. Let's see your. Bring your shoes up here. Uh, let me, let me what pull what up you chair. got? What you got? Bring your shoes. It's uh, what's on your feet. Oh my! So I'd like to call out not about what's on my feet on the outside, but on the inside. Oh here. my God! Look at got the these new uh, buffer swag socks last night. Holy macaroni! And they're awesome. I've Did never... you borrow these from Sean Fedorko? These look surprisingly. I like... might have raided his closet because I'm really <laughs> jealous of his attire, and I aspire to be as uh, as uh, dapper as Sean one day. Yeah. So yesterday we were hanging out with Sean at Cloud Nine. And he was, as you, as he always does, impeccably dressed. <laughs> and his tie was just slightly wrinkled. Someone actually came up to him mm -hmm. and straightened his tie because, you know, it's the whole thing, right? <laughs> you got to maintain. You got to take shots. <laughs> That's a maintain. Yeah. And then take your shot. <laughs> All right. On behalf of Matt and the entire render effect, you know what? Why don't we get a couple of the render FX people to come over here? Come on, come on, come on over. over, come on over. We've got people. We we've got to introduce everybody, right? <laughs> I gave I gave fair, fair warning yesterday. This is Peter. Say hello, Peter. Hey guys. Internet, say hello to Peter. Hello. Internet, there's Internet. Peter. And over here, what you going to It's Elena. Elena, <laughs> say hello to Elena. And no one else is here. No. What is the deal? <laughs> Start up. They, well, I told them we're live streaming on and Friday. And they avoided us like And they're like, oh, I'm feeling really sick. Uh, <laughs> the stuff is happening. All right. Well, behalf, on behalf of Matt and the whole RenderFX team, thanks for tuning in to Ventures Live. And be sure to check out the RenderFX hands-on <laughs> workshop where you can actually meet Matt, learn about the tools, mm -hmm. and actually by registering for the RenderFX workshop, you get a whole month of render effects right. for free. That's right, unlimited access. Yep. It'll, It'll be, be awesome. awesome. That's yep. February 16th. All you need to do is go to the eMarketingLearningCenter.org That's website right. and you can register right now. That's so, right. I'm still Brian Slaywin. Hey, where's my business card? I don't know. I'm still Brian Slaywin. No, that's your business card. <laughs> uh, and you can reach us at underscore Ventures Live on Twitter. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next week. Thank you. Have a great weekend. Go your favorite team. I'm not even sure who my favorite Go team weary. is. I don't about really that. care. All right. Thank you, everyone. See ya. Bye. Goodbye. Okay, bye.